Hey everyone, today we're going to be building a bat house with me, someone who has never built a bat house before. You're going to need wood, building stuff, and a saw. Gloves if you want, <coughs> and some glasses. Um, you always need safety glasses, and condoms, and sunscreen. You need all three of those things on your body at all times. So I'm going to take my regular glasses off, put on my uh, safety glasses, where are they? Skinny. <laughs> and we're going to make a bat house. Step two is write down the dimensions from the internet. 26 inches, oh wait a minute, maybe we should make sure this wood is square. Okay, hang on a second, I'm going to square up the wood. So, I would, this is all dusty, because I happen to have wood in my spare wood pile. Everybody has extra wood around their house. I just happen to have some. And it's already the correct dimensions, which or 24 inches this way and whatever I want to cut this way 26 and a half right about here if you can see my hand over here 26 and a half that way the next piece we're going to cut is 16 and a half inches so it's going to be about this long. And then you need a third piece, which is five inches. Which is about that long. So, I'm going to square up the wood and cut all these pieces, and I'll see you back here in a second. Step two. <coughs> now that I have all the pieces of wood cut, try six and a half inches, try four and a half inches, five inches, you want to put a little half inch gap in here for ventilation. You want to get some of these wood sticks. They're about $2.50 for 12 of them at Home Depot. And you want to put it in there. Kind of like a sandwich. You're going to put them in like that. This is just a mop up. I'm not inhaling anything right now, I'm just showing you guys. It goes like that, basically. And you put another one over the top, inside, of course. And you just, that's it. That's all there is to it. The little bats fly in here. I don't know who you can see on the camera. The little bats fly in there. And they make their home in here. And this is a vent for air. And that's about it. And you hang this up. That's all there is. Hopefully, I'll have like 50 bats in there. Delete all the mosquitoes. Oh, I almost forgot. You're going to have to scratch up the inside of your box so the bats can grab onto it with their little feet. Their little feet. So this piece, I just cut it off from this piece. It goes in there. And just scratch this up. using a edge of a screwdriver so I'm going to scratch all that up the little bats can grab stick their toes in there stick their little cute toes in there and hang upside down ta-da there you have your very own easy to make bat house
Ta-da! And there you have your very own easy to make bat house. Nail the pieces together. That's all there is to it. Hang this up on the east side or south side of your house at least uh, 12 to 20 feet off the ground and about 20 feet away from any trees and hopefully next spring you'll have some bats.